So what's going on everybody and welcome to another redstone video and today I'm going to be showing you a sorting system that I came up with. I got the idea from Il Mango who recently added movable tile entities add-on to his skyblock realm uh, for his patreons and stuff and he was designing the sorting system for that and that's where this idea came from. So the basic concept uh, this isn't going to be a block by block tutorial but I will uh, provide a world download link in the description. But basically this is the concept right here. So what you do is you have the items flowing in. They get aligned to this chest. And that way it lines it up on the very corner of this block. So these hoppers can pick up the items through the corner. And then the water stream comes this direction. Now right here this is where your item sorter will go. And once this reaches a certain number of items, um, it will start transferring items into the hopper by extending this signal right here. And it looks like there's a bit of a bug going on. So let me go ahead and redo that. Uh, well, well, that's kind of... Uh, Alright, there we go. But anyways, once this reaches signal strength 4... It will loop up to here and fire the sticky piston that pushes this hopper down. And when the hopper gets pushed down, these items can transfer over into here. And then it starts transferring down into this bottom chest just like a normal sorting system would. And no items get left behind in here. Now, for this system to work properly, you have to have any item that stacks up to 16. And you'll just have one in each one of these slots as a blocker. And then the rest of the items are just whatever you want to in, want to sort out. And then you just have like a few half slabs that loop up to here. Now this is 100% tileable, which means you can stack them side by side. It has the same pros as some of the other sorting systems like Silent Whispers and um, Impulse SVs where it has overflow protection. So if this ends up getting backed up, it will not affect any of these other systems. It, uh, these other systems next to it will not drain out. But anyways, uh, let me just go ahead and show you guys pretty much the, the concept of it. So let me go ahead and grab these glass panes out. And the items will get transferred into this water stream via whatever method that you choose. And then they get aligned by that chest over here. And they filter down, which they won't filter all the way down because this one right here does not actually have an item filter. But if I was to come over here, this is the slime block section that I have for the sorting system. And if I was just to come over, let me see, let me grab some slime balls. It'll let me grab them real quick and then I'll show you guys what this does. So if I come back up here and I grab these slime balls and I start throwing them down in this water stream, they will start getting collected by this first hopper and you can see that piston extends so that these can travel down into here. Um, if you have a really fast farm, it's probably a good idea to have this water stream circle around and come down to the end and then loop back around to the start so that it keeps going in a solid stream because these hoppers can only pick up a certain number of items per second and if you have a really fast farm a lot of the items will get missed but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial it's more like a showcase than anything but i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did please leave a like and subscribe and i will see you all in the next one peace